Now we're leveling off. Huh? Look at this. <laughs> we <laughs> literally finished talking, and now we're flat to a downhill. Yeah, so perfect. Nicely uh, played, sir. So today I'm out with uh, some buddies, and I've been invited on a ride. We're currently climbing a hill. Yeah. And so I don't have to talk. I'm gonna uh, pass it to the guy yeah, who you know. I really appreciate that. That's uh, who invited me. So. This little mission was thought up as uh, for human-powered movement. Where riding from where Human Power Moon is based in Charlotte out to Defeat International, which is a manufacturing company that do socks, apparel. So Human Power Movement ordered about 12 dozen socks for an event we have coming up. And I said, well, hell, why don't we get a bunch of knuckleheads together to ride in true Human Power Movement fashion, pick up the socks and ride back. I am just the one that has somehow tricked everybody into <laughs> pack muling socks back to, for me. That's the whole, that's the novelty of this. I've tricked everybody into this. When Adam talks about pack muling socks, everybody has either frame yeah. bags. Yeah. It's easier to order mass produced socks wherever, have them shipped to your door. We've said, well, look, that may be okay, but we're gonna go local. We're gonna go US made. U.S. sourced and partially recycled. And we're also gonna ride our bikes to go pick them up. May not be the easiest route, but in our opinion, it's the right way to do it. So it's exactly what we're doing. So we have, to, we have to pick up all these socks and somehow stash them on our bikes and go, yeah, I don't know. Anybody know the route? I don't think, this is a, this is a golf course. I've never gone for a ride just for socks, so yeah. like that was, <laughs> and to be clear, intriguing. <laughs> we also have a bet going. Samuel, if you want to oh, yeah. see it set up, so the over-under, over under of and he said it, he set this for the bet, he said four, four dozen, dozen, which is 96 <laughs> socks is what it is. <laughs> yeah, so that, gonna, that sounds right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm anxious to see. <laughs> I want to, honestly, I want to see if we can get Sam with a triple digit sock. So, just arrived here at Defeat. Our main man, Shane Cooper, yep. met us outside, bright smiles. I've been telling a story about sustainability and being environmentally conscious and intentional with our decisions. Right. And that is, again, a big reason why. We love what you guys are doing. We're happy to ride our bikes here, load up with some socks, and take them back to our to our folks. I've got my four. I've, I've really? set them aside. How many do you have? I got three in here right now. Is that a high score? Dude, you're a high scorer. High score. Sam, where you at? Three? Hey, I haven't started on my seat back yet. Okay. Hey, I've got a I've got a spare dozen. Do we need another one? Shh. <laughs> your bike is looking empty. I don't no, know. No, no, no. That's your bike. I got it. I think it is. Help me out. Help me out. Boys, if this is his bike, there's nothing in it. <laughs> Wes! Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Extra large. Who wants it? So one of the really cool things about this ride today is the people that are on it. I mean, you have in the front at this moment, you have Bill from Recover Brand, which he's way up front. Behind him, you have Brian Misters, who him and his wife Chelsea put on the Around the Crown race. Great people and would not probably label himself as a cyclist, but he's doing 100 miles, so. Then behind him, we've seen this guy quite a few times, Mr. Samuel Martin, Mr. Adam Bratton right there. And uh, he is the, he would uh, classify himself as the head enabler 
Uh, he's the one with this crazy idea to go pick up 12 dozen socks from Defeat in Hickory and uh, bring them back on bicycles of all things. So. able to do more of these hope the audio was good uh, if you liked it you hit the like button if you didn't tell me why you didn't I'll make them better until then adios <laughs>